I don't think men should be born with dicks. I think they should have to earn them like driver's licenses, right? And there's a criteria they should meet before they get their dicks. Like, they should learn how to read, right? They should get their driver's license. They need to get some therapy. They gotta play in them balls at Chuck E. Cheese for a little while so they can learn how to play with their own balls. And listen, I'm a believer in higher education, right? So if you get a degree, you get a bigger dick, right? If you get a master's, you get a couple more inches. If you get a PhD, they won't call you Dr. Dick for nothing. But if you got a GED, you're gonna have a two-inch dick for the rest of your life. Cause a big dick and a low IQ don't never do nothing good in life. And you guys are just so sexist. You're sexist. I'm going in on you. Listen, ladies, make them feel uncomfortable. Tell them how ugly they are every day. Tell them they're looking old. You need to lose some weight. You need some Botox. Here's a real fun exercise. When they go to sleep, put a pillow over their face and hold it till they start kicking. Right? Don't kill him, but just let him know that you will so that he can sleep like that all the time. He's always worried and you in that head. And keep your game face on, lady. Walk around the house and be like, yeah, boy. We going to bed early tonight? Hey. Because you guys are sexist, and you say sexist things, and I'm a feminist. And yes, I'm a Puerto Rican, Latina, Afro-Latina feminist, and I bang for my ladies everywhere I go. And I'll tell you, you say sexist shit like you're such a bitch, your period must be on. Maybe she's just mad you woke up this morning. <laughs> right? She turned that sleep apnea machine off, and your big neck ass woke up, and she's like, oh. Fuck, this motherfucker woke up today. Yes, you don't know how to mop a floor. You don't know how to wash dishes. You touch your little rusty, crusty balls and then touch us without washing your hands. And that's so disrespectful. Every last one of you, your balls only smell good to you. So get a little fanny pack with some antibacterial in that bitch before you touch us. We got on lotions that cost $35 that come out of these containers, and here you come with those rusty, crusty ball hands. Every single one of you have touched your balls at some point this evening. This room smells weird because there are balls in here. Every last one of you. You know it, every last one of you have touched your balls tonight. I don't even shake dudes' hands anymore. I'm like, yo, dap me up, dog. Dap me up. Don't touch me. They're always trying to make women feel dirty. Every other commercial, Summer's Eve, Massengill, where the fuck is the ball scrub? <laughs> they need a whole aisle in Target of ball scrub. They need Summer's Eve with bleach ball scrub. They need Massengill with degreaser ammonia combo ball scrub. My name is Aida Margarita Paradas Rodriguez. Thank you.